Hello, hello, you fine ass people. How the hell are you doing? It's your friend Cam from beautiful Vancouver, Canada. Man, it was a beautiful fall day today. Absolutely fan flipping tastic day. Um, went out, saw some of the fishies are spawning today. I put that up on the Discord. Uh, for anyone who's on the Discord, um, I share kind of more um, non YouTube video stuff there. So that was really cool. And uh, man, it, it's this was a really good day today. Of course, being part of a long weekend helps with that, but I'm just, I'm just in a great mood right now. Fantastic mood. Um, we are in episode 14. I don't know why I put one hand. We're on episode five. It's episode 14. I just have to do something with my hands. I don't know. Um, of Ghost of Tsushima, and we're not slowing down. We're not looking back. We're having a good time with it. Yeah. <laughs> Nikki likes to call it Ghost of Sashimi. <laughs> Oh man, Sasmashi, yeah. <laughs> it is of course uh, the Canadian Thanksgiving weekend, so happy Thanksgiving to all of my Canadian friends. And if you are an American friend, then uh, you get yours next month, and we'll be celebrating with you and wishing you the best during your time. Ooh, that thunder though, damn! It's like this whole half of the the northern half of the the I island. Go back. It's just all thunder, lightning, gray skies. You know how it is? All right. So, where are we? Aha, we are over there. Kind of made our way through. So, there's a huge swath of white area all over the damn place. Like, this is still a... We still got a lot to go. I'm okay with it, because the game's been pretty freaking sweet. But, now, Liberati Kishibi Village. That's where we almost... I think that's where we got absolutely wrecked. Wasn't it? No, is this it? No, that's not it. We were trying to go over here. Did I fight him? Yes, I did. There were, like, remember the beginning of last episode, we rode past this place, and the warning said, um, there's a lot of people here, and I said, fuck it, and I got killed like this. <laughs> so, I think that's what this is? I, I'm not sure, though. What's up, Flame Sir? Good to see ya. I'm glad you got uh, that hat for Thanksgiving. That looked really nice. And happy Thanksgiving to you. Looks like, like you had some good Thanksgiving dinner, family. Actually, put your usual bag on someone's spilled chocolate popsicle and truth. Ew, no. Oh, that sucks. Ugh. Oh, I'm really sorry to hear that. Hopefully, it'll be able to come out well in the wash. Okay, we're right here. You know what? Fuck it. Let's go straight for this, this guy right now. The duel under autumn leaves. I think that's our last one. Let's get it done. I'm here for it. Where's our horse he at? There he is. You're doing good, Sora. All right, which way are we going? Shit, we gotta get all the way up there, bro. I don't know how we're gonna do that. Actually, hold on. Let's talk to this person. What's up? Have you seen the foxes, my lord? Oh, all the foxes. I was meditating when a young one sat down before me. Aww. Foxes are wise. They must have sensed your kindness. When I spoke to her, she stood and waited for me to follow. The fox. Mm -hmm. She led me to a shrine. I gave thanks to Inari for the beautiful experience. The kami brings us light in even the darkest times. Hey, man. I would love to have a, a fox just, like, sit beside me and, like, lead me someplace. That'd be sweet. Okay, so we gotta get up here somehow. How the flip are we gonna do that, though? How are we gonna do that? Okay, so we wanna go this way. Okay, that I can do. Hopefully it does. If not, well, they're only a dollar to London drugs. Yeah, I know. It still sucks, though. I remember when I was in high school, I was walking down the road, and some dudes came out of a Wendy's. They roll past, and they drive by ketchup to me. And I was wearing white tearaways on. And I had to have that shit on my legs, on the bus, all the way home from, like, Coquitlam Center to Maple Ridge. I know, I, I, I know you have a general idea. Elizabeth, you should have a general idea where that is, too. <laughs> That's weird. I know. Oh, fuck. Really? Yeah, and the eggs hit my neck so hard that they Ow. Skin. That would have hurt. Dad and his kid clean up my crime 
<laughs> well, if you had two sons, you knew they were going to get girlfriends eventually, so he probably got... Ooh, this is beautiful. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's... It, it was so weird, man. It, it sucked. I don't know why people do that shit. Yeah. Yeah. Hey man, at least they were throwing fucking ketchup and not <laughs> the shit out of each other like they are now. Yeah. What's this? Okay, hold on. Like, we're kind of finding places here on the way. How's it going, everybody? How you doing? I'm gonna... Ooh, Mongol artifacts? What do we got? Dried meat. Pretty sure that's an artifact of every civilization. Air dried and ground meat called borts is used as rations by Mongol troops. Borts is easy to transport, cooked simply with water, and is often kept under the saddle to further tenderize it. Makes sense. Anyone hungry? No one talk to me? Okay. I don't take it personally. Anything in here I could uh, borrow? There it goes. Some steel. <laughs> I'm glad you're having a happy day, Elizabeth. That's awesome. Happy days are great. I agree. Today's been fantastic. It's beautiful freaking fall weather out here. Fantastic. We got to see a bunch of uh, salmon today. Salmon row spawning. Get the kids down to the river. I posted that video. I put a little video up on uh, the Discord for that, too. Oh, well, let me do the thing. Hold up. Oh, oh, there we go. I can climb up here. Cool. Yeah. <clears throat> I do have to say, I'm still recovering from the end of Death Stranding that we finished. The, not last night, like the night before. I'm still recovering from that. Even with your very hand sore? Okay, well, I'm glad it's... Once again, a good day for you, Elizabeth. I figured this would be like a little shrine thing, but I guess not. Pretty cool view, though. Hope your oval team cut your thumb. Aw. Some always gotta happen, right? <laughs> that was something, I bet. Are you guys... Oh, shit! I forgot I had my explosives on. <laughs> Guess we got a little bit of bacon. <laughs> Yo, they killed that guy? Oh, they didn't kill that guy. I didn't... <laughs> Anyone? Guess that bacon's gonna be a little extra crispy. <laughs> Whoopsie! <laughs> did not mean to do that, but it was pretty funny, though. That's great. <laughs> You're focused on giving Luna belly rubs? Well, yeah, I mean... Can't not when animals are so easily distracting, especially when they want rubs and cuddles and stuff. All right. Okay, a little Karen there. I feel like the dude's at the top of the mountain. He's got to be. Uh, maybe not. Well, he's over that way. Maybe there's just like something else up here. I don't know. There we go. This looks like a foxy shrine. Hey, the fox came out of nowhere. Totally meant to find a fox shrine on my own. Nice. I wish you recorded it. Aw. Can I pet you? Absolutely. He's so happy. No, let me pet you. There it is. <laughs> Makes me so happy. There better not be any more fox violence on this episode, man. That shit pissed me off. 
last episode. People are hurting the foxes. Yo! That fox went flying, dude! Holy shit, do you see that? That fox put on his Reebok pumps, man. He had some Air Jordans on. Sheesh! The fox went crazy. Cool. Alright. Let's continue. Where's my horse at? There he is. Oh, he ran into a tree. Come on, Sora, what are you doing? I hope this guy's gonna be a pain in the ass to find. But I feel like this is gonna run out here in a second and we'll be fucked. Yup. Alright, time to get off the horse. It's a super fox, right? Yeah. Okay, no, we're gonna get to him. Okay. So he's got... Oh, is it down? It's down there, isn't it? At this time of year, that's actually perfect because, of course, it's gorgeous here with all the, the leaves turning and falling right now. Absolutely gorgeous. It's Nikki's favorite time of year. Oh, hello. Yeah, she grabbed a bunch of pumpkin spice shit today. <laughs> yeah, it's rolling all the way down. You drop down there, so there's gotta be a way to keep going, right? Like, if we jump down, we're dead. We're not doing that. Jump over here. Huh? Is there a climb down here? Uh oh, whoa, 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 whoa. There's definitely not a climb there. Definitely not. <laughs> Shit. Alright, let's go back this way. Yeah, the scenery is beautiful. As long as it doesn't get us killed, you know. Hope no one's afraid of heights. No, okay. So, how the flying fornication do we get down there? So there's a path. Okay, we have to go back up, back over, and then there's a split path. Then we'll fight Buddy Boy. Okay, cool. Yeah, absolutely flame straight. I'm glad it was not raining today. It was just a great day to hello. There we go. <laughs> great day to enjoy the the long weekend for sure. Yeah. All right, Sora, let's go. A DNS error has occurred. Why does that? What? Okay. Hopefully that doesn't mean we lost our internet connection here. No, we're still good. Weird. Huh. Wow. You're afraid of heights? When you're in a plane and be near the window? Wait, hold up. If you're afraid of heights, why would you want to be near the window? Because then you can see the heights. Or are you are you someone, Elizabeth, that like attacks their fear? You're like, I'm afraid of this, but I'm going to fucking, you know... Go in, like, and, and just go at it, even though you're scared shitless of it. Here we go. This is our first big, this first fight of the night. Not even a big fight, just a fight in general. <laughs> We're probably going to die a couple times. Probably going to die a couple times. Okay, got the the lance, 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 lamp slit. There we go. Look at this. This is gorgeous. What a poetic place to fight to the death. Finally, I was getting tired of waiting for you. Didn't you just come for me, bro? Blame me for that shit? What? You kill all these guys? Yeesh. So you really are an asshole then. Okay. Here we go. This is madness. You're not a warrior, just a murdering dog. That's the spirit. Come on, Sakai. I've been looking forward to this. Okay. Hey, what's good, Edward? Good to see ya. Happy Sunday night. Hope you're doing well. This is our very first fight of the whole night, so we're probably getting our ass kicked. <laughs> All right. 
the showdown. The leaves just make it so much cooler looking. <laughs> okay. Okay. I, like I said, this is our first fight of the night here. Okay. Yo. for it. Shit! I fucked up. Hold on. I think we got a host there or something. I'm in the middle of a fight. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm here now. Dude, that combo is crazy. This guy is crazy, man. Plus, I'm blocking those. I'm pressing L1 on time. All right. Like I said, we're going to get killed a couple of times here. It's just, that's our first fight. This is like the hardest dude. So, that was a little bit more. Wait for it. What? I hit him, though. Oh, I fucked up. There we go. Got him. This guy's got a lot of health, too. What's going, buddy? I'm here now. Doing a lot better now. My horse is just sitting by watching. Just chilling. Yo, how come? Wait for it. We almost got him. Whew. Damn. He got me on that step through, though. That leaf got my way here. Almost got him. As long as we don't fuck around. Let's go! <laughs> Dude, for our first fight of the night, all it took was one time to kind of warm us up. Whew. I think that's all the samurai that we need to get. I think. Kill again. Who is the man who sent these Ronin after me? Right, okay, we did. Position in Umugi Cove may have an idea where Kojiro is. Nice. So we still have to fight one more dude who sent these guys after us. Whew. Okay, hold on. Did I get it? Like, I something triggered what? Well, either there's a follower, a host, or something. Whatever that was, I appreciate you. <laughs> Uh, Jepson, I feel that you're lying through your teeth, dude. You're just trying to plug your Discord, so fuck off, bro. Yeah, bro. <laughs> That's so insincere. Yo, I love your content, man. Follow my Discord. Like, come on, dude. We see so through you. Stop it. That disingenuous shit, hey. If that's getting you a lot of people on your Discord, it's just there for follow for follow and announcing when they're going live. That's all there is. There's no genuine shit going on, buddy. And even if there is, if that's how you're doing it, nah. Nah, nah, nah. Cool. So, that was a dub. Now, the question is, where's the last guy at? I don't know. That's Lord Shibu's camp. Like, I don't know where to go for that. I'm looking on the map. See, there's all the Ronin that we, we took care of. Oh, that's the chick. Okay, let's go. Let's, let's fast travel there. Fast travel. <laughs> Flame shift, that's so transparent, even to me. <laughs> it's like, come on, man. Uh, people need to teach these people, like, some sales skills, right? The other night, last night, 
because what I try to do, guys, I do go into other people's streams to hang out. At no point do I ever say, hey, I'm also a streamer, right? Hey, I just did this. Oh, hey, you, you talk about this game? I just streamed it. Here's my link. Like, that is such a rude thing to do. I'm there. When I went there, I find people who are playing games that I like. And then I actually just engage. Like, hey, man, how's the game going? Is this your first time playing it? Hey, that was awesome. Like, if they had a good play, talk them up. And then naturally, at any point, if they ask me or it comes up, it comes up. If it doesn't, but I like the way they held themselves, I drop a follow for them. But never do you do that shit, man. Never. It's, ugh, trash bag. Okay, where's this person at? That's true, but I think there's there's lots of resources online. Like, he, if he can go live, he can do a search and like, hey, what are some of good things to do as a as a content creator? I think going straight to trash bag though is so hard. Fair enough. Okay, maybe I'll bring the trash bag back until he proves it. But I, I blocked him, so <laughs> so fair enough. Okay, I'll give you that. Whatever your sword needs. Okay, I think we. Apologies. Any more iron? Have what we need to do the work. I'll see you again. Yeah. I'm excited for that, Elizabeth. I'm sure it's going to be awesome. Okay, so where is what's her nuts, man? I gotta find her here. There it is. Well, where's the wind going? This way. Okay. So we used to know people who were in each other's Discord servers and Twitch streams, so naturally they talk about their streams were, but they were never. Yeah, exactly. If you're talking about, it, you're talking about it, right? But, yeah, the blatant... That's not her. Is it? Lord Sakai, thank the gods! The straw hats that Kojiro wanted me to do are dead. He already knew, my lord. I told you, he is no ordinary man. Okay. Saw him again. He came back, told me you earned death by his hand. He'll wait for you in a cave at Omi Monastery. My own clan's territory. Wow. You regret that insult. You mustn't face him. With that demon blessed armor, he'll never tire in battle. Okay. See about that. So I'll oh. pray for your victory. There is a tip right there. He's got some armor. He's gonna have health regen. So I don't know if I can actually deal with that. We're gonna have to find out. <laughs> And that, that's awesome, Edward. See, that ultimately, like, there's so many content creators out there. It's just a matter of building a, rep, a rapport with other people at the end of the day, right? Okay. So, where is... It's in my own territory, you said. That's not the one. I hope there's an icon. I don't know what to look for. Ooh, yo, is this it? Yo, we actually have to deal with that. I thought, hmm. There's some shit we haven't done yet. Oh, I guess we have. So where is this place at? Wow, I gotta get that. Okay. Where is this guy? Because I've been waiting, like, we've been working three episodes to get this. <laughs> Come on, where is it? Spirit of Yarakawa's Vengeance, Survivor Camp, Walls of Yarakawa. Hmm. I don't see. Oh, this is it right here. It's got to be it. Hmm. That's just a random thing. What's this? That's okay. There it is. Can we fast travel here? I can fast travel here. All right. Speaking of Maple Ridge, Nephew's number two soccer game is going to be all the way over there. It takes forever with traffic. Maybe we can compete with a hockey team. Absolutely, Flamesford. Yeah, that's tough. You surprised you got some feedback? Feedback from who? Did I give you feedback, Edward? Or... Sorry, it's... <laughs> I got a lot to go, so... 
Please forgive me if I've forgotten something. Tomorrow would be a nice day to do a stream, Elizabeth. Yeah, I mean, it's day off, all that stuff. Okay, can I get up from here? Probably not. Wait, I remember being able to get up over there. Okay. Edward, have you played Ghost of Tsushima at all? And what type of videos do you post again? Please, like I said, forgive me if we've had this conversation before. What's happened? The sashimi. That's like probably death right there. What is that? Oh, it's just. Uh oh. You gotta get across. <laughs> nice. Uh oh, shit. Alright, let's get up off the waterfall here and then. We can go after what's his nuts. I can't make that jump. We're a samurai, but we can't make that jump. Oh, hi. We can do that, though. Aha. All right. Wait, it's going that way? Fuck off. No way. Wait, what? Hold on. Wait, what? I'm going over here. There we go. That was weird. I was like, no, we came all the way over here for nothing. <laughs> there we go. That's nice. Like giving feedback, put comments? Yeah, me too. Absolutely. Lucky Genzo's in. Yo, hold up. Gentlemen. I need to try and do better with my duels tonight. Oh, never mind. I hurt my sword, my horse, asshole. Oh wow, these guys are pulling out the big shit. Ow. I love the kunai so much. What's up? Come on. Oh, he did the red one. I was waiting for. Yo, I'm actually. Ready. I wasn't ready. <laughs> These guys were all like, uh, like the other Ronin level. I was surprised they went with the red shit. Usually in these battles they don't do that. That was a really god awful battle. That was disgusting. I apologize for that. Ugh. Welcome back, Edward. Good to have you. Yeah. Man. My poor horse, like, cut. Cut him, man. Alright. We're going this way. Okay, there we go. Edward, have you uh, played any Ghost of Shishima at all? By the way? Oh, I freaking ran over that. I don't even know what that was. <laughs> so, we also have to go through a maze to fight this guy, man. That's crazy. Haha. <laughs> I am amazed. Okay, we're getting close to it here. Alright. Beat it out, have homework for the elders. It's all good, man. It is all good. Whatever works best for you. I'm just happy you're able to pop in. Okay, well, we're going to have to get him to do tomorrow, then. What homework does he have? Okay. Alright. Oh, come on, he didn't that much. You played you play beat this? Okay, nice. I'm having a blast with it. The only major complaint I have... Uh oh I kind of softlocked myself here. We're going to die. Oh, shit. No way back up or down. Damn. Oh, wow. Okay, well, time to die. <laughs> Look at the size of that. Yeet. Can I land in the water? 
Oh, I thought the water would have worked. That reminds me of, what is that movie? The other guys? Where The Rock and Samuel Jackson jump off the building like, into the bush. Oh no. We're softlocked here, guys. Like, oh, we're still alive. We're still alive. Can I jump in the water? Please, please, please. Okay, thank God. Dude, the save point was right there. Holy shit. Oh, man. <laughs> I was nervous. We put a lot of time into this. If we had lost access to this, oh, I would have been pissed. Sheesh. Okay, what's up, bro? How you doing? Oh, okay. Nice to see you, too. Land war, just know where to land, yeah. <laughs> okay. Now, here's the thing. Right now, I have very little health. So that might screw us. Yeah, he, he went splat for sure. This looks like a pretty cool place to fight. But this guy's going to probably wreck us. Is this guy Batman? He's in the Batcave in here? Lord Sakai, at last. You could have just fought me straight up, dude. It is my very first playthrough, Edward. The told me your armor was blessed by demons, Kojiro. Do you believe him? I think you should have stayed a legend. He's gonna wreck us, dude. <laughs> I'm scared. A duel on the mirror of sacred light. Here we go. I feel he's gonna have some type of health regen. I think so. Which sucks, because I have no uh, health regen right now. Yeah, butterfly. I appreciate it, Edward. Yeah, I see we're almost dead, man. Okay, we got some health back here. Yo, that combo's crazy. Dude. I haven't enjoyed killing this much in years. Yo, he's gonna trash talk me too before he does it. Okay, I might have to leave and come back because I need I need health regen. Yeah. Oh shit, I was not ready for that. Okay. Shit. He's doing a red attack. Men. What does that make you? Every death was sweet. Right. You are a demon. Huh. Okay. I need health, man. Oh shit! Shit! Oh, I'm so nervous right now. There we go. So close. The fact we got him that close. Or a ghost. Just a man. Oh, just like if we had a little bit more health, we would have had that. Is there a way I can back out of this fight just to get more health? Wow. Ow. 
Ow. Like... Damn it. Oh, wow, that sidekick got me, man. Yeah, I think we gotta try and back out and get more health, because I... I can do some... I can do pretty good, but I'm not that flawless to get through it like this. This is like on hard mode. Wow, he followed that up. Dude, that... Like, he follows it up quick. A thousand men. Every death was sweet. The musician was right. Dude, he falls it up. Enjoyed killing this much in I gotta be ready for that too. Like I'm too eager to counter on those reds. The fact that we're doing as well as we are, though, I'm, I'm feeling pretty good about it. Dude, stop it. Yo, it gave me some more health here, though. Damn. Okay, we got a little bit more to work with here. I've killed a thousand men. Every death was sweet. The musician was right. You are a demon. I'm, I'm getting used to that pattern. So, now that we are in phase two, I'm calling this phase two. What I've noticed is, in the first phase, after he does the red attack, I dodge. I can counter no problem. In the second phase, he's always following up red, red. So, you saw I missed it that time, right? See, he's doing that follow-up now. Damn it. Easy. He did a fucking triple. Golly. We're in trouble. So he falls in with a double or triple. This much in and it started me with two things of health. I still fucked up. This is a tough battle, man. I ain't gonna lie. But we're here for it. We're here for it. It's got me sweating a little bit. I ain't gonna lie. Dude, now I have three. The game's kind of giving it to me here. Damn. It's gonna be brother. He hit me on him. I killed a thousand men. Every death was sweet. The musician. The musician was right. You are a demon. Why'd I do it that way, man? Yo. I'll do a fast counter if I want to counter that. Here comes one. One. There's a quick response. Are you the one who finally killed me? Is that what you want? Close, close. Ah. Easy cam. Easy. Easy cam. No! We're so close, we're so close. Let's go!
Night night, buddy. That was a tough battle. The game kind of gave me a little bit of health back after I died a couple times, so they kind of gave it to me a little bit. Holy shit. That was a fight. That was a fight. Definitely some trial and error there. So I was a little bit wrong uh, where he did like the triple red or the double red. I just had to counter with a, a quick attack, not my, not my heavy attack. That's what the key was. Whoo! Yeah, ha, got him. Oh, good for you, Kajiro. Get a lot of people, you're an asshole. Right? Ooh, new armor. Now, the thing is, will I like it? The armor I have is pretty freaking good, though. <clears throat> Dude's gonna, like, rot in his bat cave. You're not Batman, dude. <laughs> Whew. That's like the third battle we fought tonight. Holy shit. <laughs> okay. Yeah, see, I don't know if I want this armor. I like my other armor. Let's have a look, though. So, my gear. So, Kensei armor, moderate, increased to resolve gains. Ghost weapons deal 50% more damage. Strike enemy with ghost weapons cause enemy deal 25% less damage, receive 25% more damage. That's kind of cool. Now, what was the one I had before? I think it was Gosaku's armor. So, yeah, major increase to health. Major to stagger damage. So, I'm sticking with it for now. But keep playing. You haven't run into anything yet. <laughs> That's kind of intense, man. I'm kind of scared by that. <laughs> okay, we got a couple skill points here, too. Let's deal with that. Everything's maxed here. Everything's maxed here. So let's fuck around here. Um, I already got my uh, kunai, like, maxed out. But let's do this stuff here. Reduce concentration cooldown. I like that. What's this? It's... Oh, yo. I actually think we should take that. What's this? I'm going with this one. Then I save the next one so I can uh, do do that one next. Unless, mm, yeah, we'll wait. That armor's fire. Nice. I should probably you play the Kensei armor. It's probably really good when I upgrade it, right? So let's probably do, let's see if we can get to a place to upgrade and then we can have a look. Nice. Okay. Cool. Well, there's this place right there. Let's see what's over there. Probably like a hot spring or a haiku or something, right? I think it also comes down to play style, too. Like, how you play, how well you play. <laughs> me, I'm still kind of not that good, so the extra health helps me. Is it up there? It probably is. Got Golden Birdie telling us where to go here. Is it a hot spring? Oh, just a stairway. Hmm. Okay. Confused. Okay, yeah, it's down to the right. Fully upgraded? Okay, we'll check that out. Okay. What's up, bro? How you doing? Can I ring the bell? That'd be sweet. Nah? Okay. My bad. Alright. No, that's gonna hurt us. What do I get? Some supplies. Very nice. Okay, should be able to go to the right here. You play on lethal? Catching hell in this game? <laughs> That's terrifying. I can only imagine. Like, I'm nowhere near this. Like, I'm not ready for that. There's no way I can do that. But if you've played this long enough and you're pretty pretty good, I'm pretty sure you, know, like, you enjoy the challenge. Ooh, another fox den. Yay! Where's the fox? Foxy. Foxy Fox, where are you? I don't see him. Is he up here? Oh, it's over here. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Here, Fox. Let's go play. Come on, buddy. You little bushy tail. Speaking of bushy tails, there was a massive squirrel in our backyard today. I was editing the replay for Death, our, our last episode of Death Stranding. 
And on the corner of my eye, I see this huge freaking long bushy ass tail. I'm like, what the flip is that? It was this huge fucking squirrel. The bushiest tail I ever see on a squirrel. It's crazy. You had to practice again? You haven't played in seven months? Yeah. <laughs> I would think you need practice for sure. After, if you're playing on that difficulty. Lethal Plus, is that where it's like, it's like you permadie and you start the whole game over again? Is that what that is? Or is it just lethal mode plus is like one hit you're dead? Sweet. Oh. Oh, you would. Yeah, sure. Give me some you. Okay. So we did that. Let's, you know what? We're here. Let's talk to our friend. The family man. Man, the trees in this game are freaking beautiful. Harder than regular lethal mode. Yeah, so it's basically, it's one shot. Anyone who hits you once, and you're dead right away. I think, is that right? I think that's what that is. Oh, shit. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, okay. Can I climb? We should have more areas to climb down here. Okay, we are going that way. Can I jump? Sure, that looks safe. Why not? Fuck it. YOLO! Nice! Awesome. There we go. Yeah, alright. You get used to it. So, it takes a little bit of a... There's an adjustment period, right? I would think. Oh, another gold birdie. What's up? No way! I landed in the white... Oh... Oh, we're dead. Fuck. I figured, like, the white spot in the water, like, that was deep enough. I guess I was wrong. I just want to get down there fast, you know what I mean? Okay, so we can't do that. <laughs> My bad. Nope, that'll still hurt me a lot, too. Is there a bamboo over here? That'd be sweet. Oh, here we go. We should be able to get down this way. Getting down off ledges in this game is the only one bad thing I can say in this game. Aside from that, everything else is, is fine. There we go. That does not sound like Kajiwara. Then you're a bigger fool than I thought. Jin, a word, please. Ooh. Okay. She's mad, mad. Masako, what's wrong? A man named Kajiwara recruited the men who killed my family. His name is on the list. He lives in this prefecture. That monk knows where, but he won't tell me. Junshin means well. I'll talk to him. Okay. Let's find out, shall we? All those funerals. I... Junshin, <clears throat> it's good to see you. And you, Lord Sakai. Lady Masako and I are looking for Kajiwara. You know where he is. She accused him of terrible things. I fear for his life if she finds him. Yeah, you should. Masako has good reason to believe he recruited the men who killed her family. Hmm. He would never do that. Okay. He is a humble fisherman, a loving husband and father. I think she is blinded by rage. Jushin. I need to talk to him. As long as it is just talking. Uh, one thing we have seen in this game is when people are driven to their brink, they will do horrible things to try to survive. Right? With the Mongols, like, slaughtering everybody, like, people are trying to survive. Up the road from here to the coast. Kajiwara's hut is on the beach. And that's been a very big theme in this, right? A lot of people have betrayed and whatnot just to try and survive and stay afloat in some way, shape, or form. Well, we'll take the road to the coast. Okay. Hold up.
<laughs> Thief's rap. Worn by Lord is brutally brutality is infamous. See, I don't know if this actually helps my stats at all. So at this point, it's just it's just aesthetic. That one's kind of cool. Pretty straightforward. Mm. Sure. So yeah, this ultimately is just... Damn, that looks badass. I'm wearing this. That looks pretty freaking sick. Right. And we'll upgrade shit when we can. Thank you for your help, monk. Peace be with you, Lady Musa. <laughs> the way he said that. Samurai guy? That's a cool YouTube channel name. I can't imagine what you said to Junshin that I didn't. He doesn't even try to hear me. It's like talking to a stone. I think he's afraid of you. Afraid? Why? You can be intimidating. <laughs> In our world, that is not a bad thing. We're hunting a cruel and vicious man. He was a retainer for our clan. Dependable and skilled, but quick to anger. We excused his behavior until the day I caught him beating his wife and daughter. Ooh. Coward. Hurting his own family. I dismissed him immediately. I offered his wife and daughter refuge in our house. Within a day, they'd gone back to him. It's not always easy. Especially when you think they'll change. Hmm. Domestic violence. So, Masako has witnessed domestic violence with this guy, so she... She knows some behavior, but the monk is like, he would never do that. So, where is the real story in the middle here? And I'm worried if she's just going to flap the handle and kill him, no matter what. Even if he is actually innocent of this specific crime. He may have been um, guilty of the other shit. Doesn't mean he did what she thinks he did now. But we're going to find out here, aren't we? This path should take us to the beach. We'll leave the horses to avoid being seen. We should approach with caution. I don't want to put Kajiwara's family at risk. Yeah. He has things like showing you different ways, giving hints of defense. That's really cool. That's really cool. Well, I hope that uh, he's seeing a lot of growth and a lot of uh, success with his channel. Sounds like a really cool one. Kajiwara's fishing hut. The Mongols found it. They may have already killed him and his family. There's a mm. chance they're still alive. Let's go. All right. Be very, very quiet. Oh, stand off. For sure. I don't care. We haven't gone to a... Oh, they got the fire shit. First duel of the night. Nice. Next. I love that. Oh! You did like a little spin a rooney. <laughs> okay. We got one, two, three, four, five. Once I caught a fish alive. Don't ask if you. <laughs> you don't already know, don't ask. Yeah. Oh, we got some big boys over here. Big boys. Uh oh. Okay, these guys are shield guys, right? Gentlemen. What the fuck is that? Oh, we got. Yeah, you're not doing that no more, sir. Hold on, am I? What are you doing? Oh. Boom, headshot. Yo, whoa, 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 whoa. 
and pew! What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? I don't see any more Mongols. Let's check the house Plus. for Kajiwara and his family. There we go. I wouldn't be surprised if they're dead. Oh, is this guy? How's this guy doing over here? Oh, he's down. Okay. Gotta get those supplies, though. Give me all the goodies. No goodies? Smoke bomb? A lot of smoke bombs here. New rolls of cloth. Not cloth. Silk. More than a humble fisherman could afford. Hmm. Signs are looking like he might have been working with them. This Just maybe. Is covered in blood. It doesn't look like a Mongol weapon. It's a fisherman's tool. Okay. Oh no. That's his wife and kid. This must be Kajiwara's wife and daughter. I always feared this would be their fate. Maybe the Mongols killed them? Then where is Kajiwara's body? Ev almost every person we try to help ends up dying or their family member starts dying. Like, this game is savage. There's just no... No mercy for anybody. No happy endings at all. Musical footprints leading away from the hut. What if Kajiwara survived? Ran like a coward. Yeah, he's like Fall Batman. Footprints. Okay. Kajiwara. Oh shit, here we go. Lady Masago. The Mongols attacked my wife and daughter. Quiet, snake. We give him a chance. Them. Out of love. Better me than the Mongols. Damn. It's what they wanted. You sick shit. You recruited the assassins who killed my family. Who hired you? Tell me and I will end you lovingly. Like you did your wife and daughter. Ooh. All I know is he understood. Understood what? How it feels to be ruined by you. Oh. How I was driven to poverty. The toll it took on my family. She could have got more information out of him. I couldn't stand to hear another word. Everything he said was a lie. Except about being ruined by me. Mm -hmm. I know Sadao felt the same way. The conspirators are bonded by hate. The attack on your clan was personal. Yeah. Organized by a rival samurai with a deep grudge. But I can't think of who. We'll find mm. him. Yeah, she is, man. But that makes total sense, right? Now, Ooh, he shouldn't have hated her for that. He he hurt his wife and kids, so she sent him away. And he's mad at her for that? Bruh. That's like... If I hit Nikki, and then her family, like, renounced me, kicked me out of the house, right? I didn't get, like, access to any of the resources ever again. And I'm mad at them for responding that way. That makes no sense whatsoever. You do something wrong that you get mad? Like, we're teaching our kid this. We're teaching our kid this. Like, we'll catch him doing something, right? Like, Reese, right? Yeah. Yeah. Reese will do something. And then Nikki will call him out on it, and I can overhear it, or I'll call him out, and he'll be like, oh, like, why are you mad? He's so mean to me now. Yeah, he gets mean about it. It's like, why are you mad, bro? You're the one who did the shit you weren't supposed to do. That's, that's not on us. Fuck. All I ever did was love you and <laughs> hurt you and fucking take care of you. Yeah. Like, who you? So... He got mad at Lady Masako for kicking him out. Like, she could have done worse. <laughs> Lady Masako's all about that life, yeah. <laughs> the game is deep, man. It's... Oh. All right, what do we got next on our list here? Um, ba -ba -ba. I feel like... You know, hold up, hold up. Before we do anything else, there's something way down here I, I missed. I feel like I missed. This. Like, how did I miss that? So let's do that right now. Let's get that out of the way. Sheesh. Sheesh. 
Cool. All right, before we go attack, just going to get a drink refill. Feel free to refill any snacks or drinks you guys got going on. And we'll be back in a moment or two on the other side. I appreciate you. All righty, my friends. Thanks so much for your patience and welcome back. Uh, Edward thinks it's my call. Yes, sir, it is. We're going to go after that. I don't know. When a game, I've said it before, when a game is done well, it makes you want to go discover all these things, to do these side quests, to explore and discover when it's done well. When it's not done well, you're just like, oh, fuck, okay, let's stick to the story, man. I don't care about any of that stuff. That's a really good sign that a game is done well, in my opinion. Anyway, you know. And this is one of those ones. Thank you, Elizabeth. Welcome back to you as well. Now, I hope that this place isn't crazy. Like, I'm kind of, I am kind of got PTSD from that last fort that we tried to attack um, last episode that absolutely destroyed our existence in every way, shape, or form. Like, I'm paranoid right now about this. You don't even know. <laughs> All right. So... We have to destroy the logging camp. Not just to capture, we have to destroy it. Alright, well, we can do that. There's beautiful flowers everywhere. It's just great. We haven't been back down on this side of the island in, like, forever. Okay. Okay, we're low on kunai right now, though. That kind of sucks. Here we go! So, Edward, what else are you playing right now, aside from Ghost of, Shish uh, Ghost of uh, Tsushima? <laughs> Sashimi. You call it Sushi. Sashimi? Yeah. Sushi. Yeah, I, I... Whoa, that's a cliff! Yikes! Woo! Almost, uh... Went bye bye. Oh, the log camp's on fire. Shit. Okay. Oh, a bear? Oh, badgers. Oh, hogs. I suck. Do a barrel roll. Oh, I missed the other one. That sucks. Oh, well. Made, made that thing go ass over tea kettle. <laughs> okay, I thought it was a bear. I saw all three of them. Okay, I'm hoping that because this is on like the lower side of the island, we should be fine now. Well, let's find out. Oh, this guy, this guy, he's gonna die. Recover Sashimono banners, eliminate the war camp general, free the prisoners, assassinate enemy from above. Okay. See ya! Did not mean to do that. Oh, we got buddy up there. Oh, they got a bunch of people uh, up on all of these areas. Okay. Welcome back, Edward. Good to see ya. We headshot this dude. Boom! Headshot. Done for the night working? Nice, dude. Relax. Relax. Okay, is that guy wearing a helmet? Fuck it. I think we can longbow this guy. Woo! See ya! Good night. Okay. Yo, can I get him from above? There we go. Who's <laughs> that? Nice. There we go. So now we just have to recover the Sashimoto banners. Cool. Now, where are these guys at? Oh, did you find a friend? Ah, uh, shit. Oh, well, I don't care. We're so covert ops, man. Where you going, brother? Okay, he's got a helmet, so I gotta be careful there. 
Got one, there's at least two of them. Ha, your buddy's dead. Okay, hold on. Uh, black powder bomb. Hey, what's up, buddy? Let's go. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, you lost your shield there, brother. Stop it. <laughs> I love it. Uh, swords? Ow! Can you stop, bro? Stop, dude. Dude, stop it. Eat that. Okay, we got a big boy here, right? Ow. Hold on. I totally meant to do that. That was fun. That was fun. Like, the game makes it, like... The game rewards you for being on point. And so it feels good when you hit it. And when you don't hit it, it's... Like, it's easy to accept the fact that I fucked up. As opposed to, like, the game's cheap. Because you've seen me... Oh, sorry, sir. Good night. Like, there's a lot of games where the, the controls are shit. And it's really been frustrating for me. But on this, it's like, no, I fucked up. Like, when we, when we died against the Samurai or the Ronin, that was me. And I, I'm okay with that. Totally cool with that. All right, let's go find the banners. As well. How much iron we get? One iron? That's it? Damn. Okay. Ah, there's one. Those bombs are freaking hilarious. Absolutely no mercy. Yeah, that's great. That was fantastic. Hopefully another Sashimono banner's in here. More iron. I need a lot of that. I need arrows for sure. What's over there? I see an icon. Hold up. Now let's keep walking around so we can get the banners. We'll do that. We'll do that. Hmm. I want all the goodies, man. All the goodies. Hmm. Give me the kunai. I think we were in here, right? Okay, I still need three more Sashimono banners, though. I think. Yeah, we were in here already. Oh, hello. We're in there, though. <clears throat> Give me the goodies. Sticky bomb? Sure, I'll take the sticky bomb. There's a banner. Nice. Luna looks like a fox. Aw, give her lots of pets. Records. Ooh. Conversations with the Khan 4. Lately, Kurt and Khan have spoken often of home. A lifelong 
Eagle Hunter before departing for the Goryeo campaign, he released his favorite Golden Eagle, which he nicknamed Little Brother. Then our talk turned once more to politics. The Empire is driven by family and tribal clashes, much like our competing clans here. He told me a battle for succession broke out after Genghis Khan's death about 10 years ago. Kublai Khan emerged the victor, but is by no means assured he will remain so. Coden feels that a great mistake of Kublai's rivals is a too rigid adherence to the old ways of the steppes, which he compares to what he sees as Lord Shimura's over-reliance on the traditions of the samurai. Oh, okay. A chalice. This isn't just a Mongol artifact. Chalices were, like, used everywhere. Used for anything from mare's milk to bowl, a kind of mead. Reportedly, the Mongols are even known to fill a chalice with oil and toss on unsuspecting enemies before lighting them on fire. Yeah, I could see them doing that shit. Marked on the campsite? Nice, thank you. I will have a look for that for sure. There's something over here. Yeah, what can I do? All these dead people. That sucks for them. Wow, this camp keeps getting bigger and bigger. Holy shit. Oh, there's still Mongols here. A bear? What is that? Hold on. Oh, shit. What's a dog? Stop it. Fucking dog. Once again, I love animals so much, but when there's, like, dogs, like, that are in-game that are aggressive, oh, I hate them so much. Dying Light almost, like, gave me heart attacks a million times because of aggressive dogs out of nowhere in that game. It's crazy. There we go. Alright, uh, we need one more Sashimoto banner. Here's all the prisoners, so I'll get them out shortly. Oh, this guy. What's up, brother? The hell was that? Okay. Okay, I need one more. Hey. Wait, there's enemies? Where are they? Who am I talking to? Is he up there? I can't see nobody. Oh, shit. Okay. Boom. Headshot. Yo, where are you, dude? <laughs> Good night. Oh, there's more than one. <laughs> Did I do that? <laughs> oh, I killed... Oh, it was a horse. Oh, no. <laughs> Poor guy. I killed his horse. Oh, that's just disrespectful is what that is. <laughs> okay, I see one more of those um, banners. But if I rescue the guys, I lose the banners and the bonuses, from what I know. So maybe it's over here. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Give me the supplies, sir. Is this it over here? Aha, there it is. Hey. Now we free the prisoners. Free the people. Yep. Power to the people. Here we go. A lot of iron I'm getting here too, which is good. Because that's why I need to upgrade my sword. We're, I think our sword's close to being maxed out right now. I just need to get more iron. And I can't take a supplement. I don't want it because I want the iron. There you go, buddy. I got you. 
No, Tenzin, I have not done that yet. Uh, it looks like I have a bunch of reactions we're going to be able to add to the Watches channel. There's uh, Ghost of Yote uh, trailer, and uh, apparently Death Stranding 2 has like a 10 minute trailer we're going to have to do a reaction to. So those are going to come down the pipeline here. I appreciate the interest because it tells me that there's an interest there for if I do it, then I know that you know there's people interested in wanting to see it. So thank you for that. How you doing, by the way, Tenzin? What's good, my friend? Uh, what? I rescued everybody. Oh, destroy the black powder cache. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We can do that. Let's find the cache then. Where is it? Is it cache or cache? I suppose it's it's one and the same, quite frankly. Oh, let's go with a big bang. Bruh, what? Oh, I think I have to manually... Oh, okay, that was a waste of two explosive arrows then. That sucks. Uh, I'm... We... I think I got a clip earlier today I have to download. Hey, what about the marshmallows? We have a... Or some, some weenies we can roast? <laughs> You're good? Don't teach on money, so you just had breakfast? Almost 10 a.m.? Nice. It's uh, Thanksgiving here in Canada, so tomorrow is a, a day off, which is fantastic. Ooh, nice. Got two skill points now. All right. We're just chilling here with all the destruction around us. Having a drink of sake. <laughs> okay, techniques. Um, ba, 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 This one. So I want this one. Assassin to three enemies in nearby succession. I like that. Or there's this. Mm. Nah, let's go with this. If I move quickly with precision, kill three at once. Give me an edge. Oh, that demo looks crazy. <laughs> okay, we still have one more action we can do here. And this is worth one. Okay. Uh, smoke bombs. I like this. No longer virtually affected by a bomb's blast. I like that. Let's use that one. Doing some nice upgrades here, man. We're getting shit done tonight. This is great. Oh, my horse is chilling over there. <laughs> cool. All right. Nice. And we still have question marks here. There's still... Like, this game is huge. Alright. Dude, that whole camp is done. Oh my god. Ha <laughs> ha. Beautiful. But yes, thank you, Tenzer, for reminding me and requesting it again. And I'm okay. Stay on my ass about it, too. If for some reason I don't... Wow, that's a big glowy tree. Oh, it's a fox den. Yay! Foxy. Foxy fox. Is that okay? Yeah, I, I would probably commit crimes for these foxes. They're so cute. Just in case. I thought he was going to go up the hill. I don't want to bring my horse. Grabbies! Hey, there's a beachside shrine. <laughs> I like that. So he does this, head down, and then finishes off. That's cool. Charm of Silence. And we're going to pet this little cute guy. Yeah, we are. He's so cute. Love it. Saw a photo of a fox and dog hybrid. Is that a thing? I suppose, I mean, in nature, if some type of dog got together with a fox who was in heat or something, I don't know. That would be interesting. He's so happy. Alright, cool. Okay, what else we got around here? A 
another question mark down here. Shine. Oh, that's that was already there before. Hello, McFly. All right, which way are we going? Back that way. Ooh, okay, we can do that. That sounds like it would be pretty adorable, though, Tenzin. Depending on the dog. If it was, like, an ugly dog breed, they would, like, destroy any cutest that's there. <laughs> okay. Oh no, dead people. I see dead people. Oh, Tenzin, speaking of the character Tenzin, Uncharted 2, 15 year anniversary. Uncharted 2 is 15 years old today. Holy crap. Okay, I'm not fighting those guys. Hold on. Uncharted 2, 15 years old. Crazy. <laughs> Ooh, Salt Wind Estate. Mongol territory, not for long it ain't. We about to cause some problems. Who will face me first? I, I'm doing this just because I have the combo. The problem is I have to, I have to win this standoff. Oh, it's hard to see. Yeah, I fucked up there because the grass is in the way. Hold up, whoa, 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 there's a guy hurt there. Gentlemen. Miss me. I jumped over that guy. That's sick. Ow. Okay. Miss me. Anyone else? I lost that dude because of the grass. I couldn't, like, really see. Oh, shit. Okay, who that? Where are you, sir? Show yourself. Where you at? You're in the window? Oh, pussy. Boom! Headshot! Oh, actually, it was a headshot. It was a good shot, not a headshot. Yeah, the grass kind of screwed me over on that duel. But if I hit that duel, I kill three of them right off the rip. Right? You fucked up there because the grass is in the way? Said every li <laughs> That's such a nice way of calling me out, dude. <laughs> that was That was very The way you called me out was very, very demure, very relaxed, very, very chill, very honest. <laughs> he rushed me. I love doing that. Oh, that's great. Gentlemen. <laughs> oh shit! Okay, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Like, we're just making unicorns out of these people. This is great. Keep coming, boys. I can do this all day. Ooh, okay, where are you at, sir? I don't even see you. He's just blind firing right now. Oh, hold on, hold on. Let me uh, switch it up. I got a little something for you, sir. Boom! He's gone. He's out of there. His bow and arrow let me run straight into it. Exactly. I love it, right? Probably think I could get off my shot that fast. Bow has killed the enemies with the longbow. Oh, shit. I hope I got... I hope there's two more enemies around. There is. At least two, right? Come on. Fight me. I have to use my longbow so I can get bonus points. Please fight me. Oh, gentlemen. There we go. Now I can switch back to my regular bow. That was fun. I don't even know what this area is. It's like a black salt estate. So maybe they mine salt in the area? I suppose. I don't know. Oh, this guy's clueless, though. That was 
beautiful. Heard Assassin's Creed Shadow's not doing too well. Um, I think it got a lot of negative uh, connotations because of, you know, oh shit, big shield boy. Right? I mean, a lot of people said, oh, they're trying to be too woke by having the assassin uh, be a black samurai. When apparently, like, there was some type of history there, just... Get out of here. Look at the blood everywhere. That's crazy. Thanks, Edward. I appreciate that. Yeah, the aerial attack was fun, too. There we go. Now we got the upgrade. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, shit! <sighs> Fucking cow deer thing scared the shit out of me. What the hell are you doing up here, man? Oh, my word. What is this thing doing? Demon lava. Demon thing. What is it doing? It came off the roof. I'm getting out of here. I'm not fucking dealing with this shit. Hell no. <laughs> I didn't sign up for this. I signed up for Mongols. I didn't sign up for teleporting where deer. Sheesh. These things are following me. Like, stop it. What the hell? And they ran into a rock. You are... You... Stop it. I did you a favor. <laughs> God. Good lord. <sighs> I normally don't kill deers, but that one was just... It, I, it, it doesn't even look like a deer, though. Its its face is too, like, pug-like. It's probably native to Japan. It's, it is probably a deer type, just native to Japan. Which, their deer are probably different than what's here in the Pacific Northwest. Right? Oh, no, buddy. Oh. Actually, no, I killed that guy. I'm not, I don't feel bad for it. Ah, that's what you get. All right. There's some iron here, too. That was fun. Cool. All right, what's next? I don't see any more question marks here. <laughs> Salt Wind Estate. Yeah, I think, yeah. Let's move back up to the northern side. Yeah. You're frowned upon for killing Yuzu Pan? Fair enough. That's why I don't do it often. That deer clearly had some problems. So I was doing him a favor. He was going to hurt himself. You see, he was just... He was jumping off roofs and shit, man. It's only a matter of time. I do... You know, I did him a favor. What's this? Spirit of Yarakawa's vengeance. An upset crowd. I think the musician is trying to calm them. I'll make sure he's all right. Sure, let's do that. Probably a fast travel right there. Foxy Fox. In those times. Don't know about nowadays. Yeah. <laughs> I'm still awake. <laughs> I, I was trying to cover it off, check it on Nikki. She's she usually doesn't stay up late. So she's, you know, it's up a little bit late. So I'm trying to be covert off like, oh, oh, oh you're you're there. <laughs> like, are you are you still conscious? Like, are you okay? I'm still okay. <laughs> yes, dear. Okay. 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 <laughs> I got so busted. Slowly sinking into the Yeah, you <laughs> absolutely. I started off sitting up straight and I am slow. <laughs> Good night, Stephanie. Thanks so much for hanging out with us tonight. We appreciate yeah. you. Have a wonderful sleep and an even better Monday, alright? You take care. What's up over here? Friends or do we have to fight? Okay, the friends. Oh, Tread carefully, my lord. Old Yarikawa is a dangerous place. Ooh, okay. Tell us. What happened to you? We were coming down the road and heard screams. By the time we got here, it was too late. They must have killed each other. No. It was the spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance. Spirits. Spirit. You know some of the tale, but not all. I love how we tell the story here. The samurai of clan Yarikawa 
were the most skilled swordsmen on our island. Okay. In every generation, one lord was taught their family secret. Okay. A deadly technique called the dance Ooh, of wrath. We're going to get this technique. Through any foe's defense. Oh, I'm here for this. The dance of wrath found its greatest master in Lord Tokiasa. This Yoriko. art is so good. Though beloved by his people, he resented Clan Shimura's power. That's us. to seize control. He set off a bloody rebellion that claimed countless lives. That's Lord our family. Shimura's That's our clan. Father and brothers fell to Yarikawa's dance of wrath technique. Damn. But with Clan Sakai's aid, Shimura put down the rebellion and executed Lord Yarikawa. Okay. Before he died, the traitor vowed to avenge his conquered people from beyond the grave. Now Wishful they thinking. Made offerings to his spirit at shrines in old Yarikawa's ruins. They beg for their enemies to die, and the spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance answers their calls with the dance of wrath. I want this move. I want this move. Everyone dies, storyline savage. Yeah, exactly, Stephanie. <laughs> spirit. They were merchants known for cheating their customers, Ooh. profiting from deceit. So someone prayed for their deaths. The shrines overflow with offerings to the spirit, begging him for bloody retribution. How do I find these shrines? People burn a handful of straw and flower petals to make smoke, so the spirit finds their prayers. Okay. Look to the sky, my lord. Hmm. All right. Spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance. Hopefully this won't be as challenging to get as like the six Ronin were. <laughs> I love how those flowers are basically like, blue. Uh... Yarikawa's people haven't forgotten your clan's role in their downfall. That was a long time ago. Not to them. Hmm. Dude, the Mongols are taking over. Like, don't get mad at me. It's like... <laughs> Death is all in this game, for sure. When toxic people are hired, the healthy people leave. So why haven't you left yet? Left what? Are you talking about the game or are you talking about my job? What are you talking about, Tenzin? <laughs> Hold on, what are you referring to, sir? <laughs> okay. White smoke, huh? Let's go. I see some white smoke over here. Okay, it's just kind of missed. Hold on. I gotta go f turn right here. We gotta go up there. Let's go, son. Thankfully, it's not too far. Let's look for white smoke. We got a lot of it here, but a lot of it's missed. My job? Um, well, here's the thing. It's, it's... I... The, the people aren't toxic at my job. The people are not toxic. Um, the situation is a lot of... Ch the challenge for me is amount of work, lack of staff. And right now, I now have some resources I have to use. Now, the problem is those resources are also being shared with other people. So I have to try and make things work with what I can. So. But I would say I like the people. Okay. No. In the, the last office Nikki worked at, that was toxic. The last two offices, actually, she worked at were toxic. Which is crazy. Right. In my, my situation my like my direct superior is very direct very frank but i can still have very direct conversations with them very open conversations in like um conversations where, where he basically can challenge me and call me out for the job i'm doing but i can also go back and say well listen here's this here's the details here and then what happens out of that is we kind of come and say he's like well what about this have you thought about doing this i'm like okay Right? So we're able to kind of fire back. I had a boss previously where it was also... It was, it, I'd say it was more toxic with the direct manager I had previously where 
you could kind of trade bars, but it wasn't productive. It wasn't productive. With my current direct report that I report to, we can kind of be direct with each other and he can call me out. I can call his concerns out, but it's productive. We're going towards a goal. So that's why I, I don't see it as toxic. The other one, that's where that one was toxic. It didn't do anything. Right? Just say he got fired for getting caught being an asshole. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. White smoke. <laughs> No, my, my situation is, is definitely challenging at my job. I believe there's opportunities here to improve it and make it better. Um, so, the other thing is in my position, I also have a, a bit of a visibility of, oh, there's the smoke for sure, of the fact of how my direct report, like they're trying to build an organization, they're trying to build a business, right? So they also have to balance growth with existing staff, with um, all the costs that come with all that shit, so... It's very interesting to be at that level where I can kind of see that and understand it as opposed to just being not not really understanding some of it. So productivity is key, yeah. The message for the spirit of Yerikawa's vengeance. The Mongols enslave our people. They camp along the Kushi River, not far from this shrine. Destroy them. I guess we're gonna be the spirit for now. The Mongols enslave our people. They camp along the Kushi River, not far from this shrine. Destroy them. This is my fight. Not the spirits. Mm hmm. So let's get into a fight, shall we? We'll grab this. Wow, look at that fire. That's very bright. Oh, shit. Someone already beat us to it, though. Productivity is key. Yeah, productivity is key. I think communication is also key, though. Communication is huge. The spirit cut down the horse. There's also like in, in there's also in some professional development that I've been able to utilize and go through as well, right? So that skill tells me that there's a lot of impressive skill to uh, focus on improving the staff as well, and that goes through to me and other people who are I guess at management level to the people who report to us. Why were they killed? So it, there's focus on improving the skills of our people and myself. Let me out, please, my lord. Calm down, I'll free you. There you go. What's up, buddy? Tell me what happened. The spirit. He cut through them all. Then he left. Thought I was going to die in a cage. Who were these people with the Mongols? They're the ones who sold me to them. You're Ugh. free. Go. Slave. Yikes. Thank you. Slavery sucks. The spirit moved on. Perhaps to another shrine. Okay. Alright, looking for more white smoke. Hmm. All right. Looks uh, look for more white smoke. Look at the stars. Gorgeous out there, Nate. Okay, we're looking for white smoke. Now, the difference here, a lot of fog and, and bits of tufts of cloud, but not actual. The smoke, I found, like, kind of rose straight up, in a way. Can we climb up there? Yeah, we can. Let's do it. Let's do it. I have no idea why I did it like that, but fuck it. All right, we're back in the thick of it here. Okay. I hope there's only like three of these because this is kind of like challenging. Oh, mm, is it fog or is it smoke? That looks like smoke to me. There we go. That's different. Let's get it. Oh, shit. That sucks. I found the smoke. I can't get down. Over here, maybe. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. 
But you shall not pass. Oh, here we go. Nice. I feel like you came down here before. Why don't we get our horse to make this a little bit faster, you know? Oh, we're already here. <laughs> I finally get my horse, and we're here. <laughs> Survivor camp. A shrine to the spirit of Yeriko's vengeance. Someone left a message. What do you got? Hitaro is a traitor to our people. He's at the camp nearby. End his worthless life. Dude, some of these prayers to the spirit are fucking savage. Hitaro is a traitor to our people. He's at the camp nearby. End his worthless life. They must mean the survivor camp. It is very nearby. It's like right here. <laughs> Holy crap. Hello, everybody. Lord Sakai, how can we help you? Sounds good, Elizabeth. You is Hetaro. I am. Someone asked the spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance to kill you. Why would they do that? He's a Mongol spy. Sneaks off every night for hours. Won't say where he goes. I've done nothing wrong. If you're helping the Mongols, I will find out. Yeah. I would never do that. Please, let me prove it. That's fair. Let's go. Make him confess, my lord. I'll explain, but not here. Follow me. Sounds good, sir. Let's have a chat. I'll take that bamboo while we're at it. I can't believe they prayed for my death. You should be more concerned about me. I'm ah. not the spirit. I'm real. Woo. My lord. I've seen it. Really? Where? On the road. Three bandits tried to rob me. The spirit cut their throats and vanished. Damn. Imagine you're just chilling by the fire. This freaking samurai dude with the whole getup comes like, yo, someone's been praying for your death. You know this? <laughs> like, can I shake your hand? Like, can you say hello first? Yo, someone's praying to kill you. Mm. All right, buddy. Time to have a chat. What do you got for me? He's probably helping people out privately or something. What's this? This is where I come at night, my lord. A grave. A grave. Who's buried here? Wife? His name was Tojiro. Brother. We were close. But his wife and family were at the camp. I can't explain why I visit without hurting them. I understand. But the people at your camp don't, and they're scared. It's not safe for you. Where else can I go? Make your way to Ariake. Go. Before it's too late. Thank you, my lord. I don't know, man. I think you should tell them. Listen, dude. Like, your husband... Whatever you want to say. Whatever you think about that being close. Whatever you think about that. You could just say to them, listen. Your husband's buried up there. He was my friend. And I go to honor him every night. That's all you gotta say. Done. Easy. That, they, that was a mountain out of a molehill. That's, that's some bullshit. That, that's crazy, man. That, that was... Man. That, they just made that into a big-ass deal. It didn't have to be a big-ass deal. What's up, Sora? Okay. Let's go look for my, uh, more white smoke. Hopefully, it's only one more. That moon's gorgeous, though. Let's go up top, see if we can find something. Where are we in the map here? Okay, we're going to the fringe. Easy, horsey. Okay. Got some clouds. Ah, ha, ha. I almost went pirate. I was always like, "Thar she blows." I have no idea why. <laughs> there we go. Who want to hurt the horsey? Another shrine to the spirit. If there was a message here, the spirit already claimed it. Hmm. 
A battle close by. What's that? Is this a ghost? Like, like, what is this? Legit, man. Shit's going down. I can hear it. Over here. The sounds are gone, though. Probably because I was going the wrong ass way. <laughs> Oh, yo, 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 yo. Shit's going down over there. I see him. Let's get on on this. Oh, dude's dead, man. I can't get in there. There's a way in through that opening below. Okay. Someone's been living here for a long time. Well, what happened here? Written by an educated hand. But the words are nonsense. Something about the Lord Yerikawa being alive. Hmm. Guy's gone crazy. Any goodies up here? Nah. Uh, nope. Okay. Ooh. Offerings taken from the shrines to the spirit. Hmm. Worn by a samurai of Yarikawa. All right. A banner of Clan Yarikawa. Did a samurai of Clan Yarikawa survive? I have to find whoever this is. Need to look for another shrine offering. Another one? Ah. Okay. More white smoke. All right. Gotta look to the sky. Who killed this guy, man? You don't even know what's going on. Wee. Where are you at, White Smoke? That's the moon. I'm trying to look to the sky, but not much is really showing up here. There's our horse. Plus, there's a lot of trees in the way, so it's kind of hard to see. A lot of fireflies, though. Crazy amount of fireflies. Yo, this feels very... I got you loading up the game now? <laughs> hey, man, I'm glad to be an inspiration, my friend. <laughs> okay, I feel like this is like going to be the end of the mission right here. This seems very... Like, kind of a sacred spot, you know? But we're not there yet. Okay, let's just kind of go. Tower? Yeah, you know what? I like the idea, Stephanie. Let's go. I like the idea. I like the idea. I was going to a high vantage point, right? Good call. Nothing really. Hmm. It's being sneaky. Very, very sneaky, sir. Okay. Come on, give me something. 
Give me something to work with. I'm just kind of right now just running randomly, moving my camera around just to get something. See if I can catch anything. Oh, nah. Don't see anything yet. Just after we start getting used to it, too. So that's a settlement there. Okay. This is a little frustrating, ain't gonna lie. But come on, man. What's up, brother? I hope I have what you're looking for. I think I've upgraded everything That's except for the wind I chime. Right now. I, I never use the wind chimes ever. Yeah. <laughs> fully upgraded. Fully, fully. I don't need ammo. Well, fuck it. You know what? Let's get it done. Ooh, cost predator hides though. Nope, I'm not gonna do that right now. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> yeah, do that. Where the fuck is this white smoke, man? Where are we in the map? Okay, we're kind of like dead center. I think we're just going to try and do a perimeter and kind of look inwards. See if anything catches our eye. Except, well, we better not run into rocks. That would hurt. <clears throat> That's not good. It's not white smoke. It's smoke, nonetheless. Is that outside of our area? No, it's, it's kind of inside. Yo, you use the shine that much either? Yeah, me either. Yo, something's up here, dude. This ain't white smoke. This is death smoke. What the hell happened here, man? Everything's dead, but then you got the big-ass bonfire. Oh, no, no, no. We already did this spot. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Itchy ear. Yeah, maybe, Stefan. Maybe. It is quite possible. Where are we at on our map? Okay. Yeah, we're just going to try and do perimeter here and see. See, we got all this mist. There it is. Got it. That's what we've been looking for, baby. All right. Now I'm going to fight this guy. Is he going to be on our side? I think if it is like a Yarakawa Samurai, he might actually try and... Fight us just because he was against us Lord back in the day. Spirit. Lord Sakai is the last of his clan and a servant of the dog Shimura. Lead him to the Garden of the Gods so they may witness his death. Someone doesn't like us. Hmm. Now we're the ones people are wishing death upon. Prayer to the Spirit. Kill me. I'll go to the Garden of the Gods and end this. Yeah, and we already found that Garden of the Gods, so let's go. Who's that? I told you that Garden of the Gods was, like, gonna be a, a, a special no, no. spot. What? Hi. What's up? What do you know about the Garden of the Gods? Only that it's a beautiful field of white flowers. Yeah. Okay. Why would you want to talk to me, then? How'd you know I was looking for that spot? That's creepy. Ooh, that's that's not good. Got Mongols blowing their horns over there. Okay, it's over this way from what I recall. Oh, white smoke. Lord Sakai. What? Yo, who was that? Hello? Who's talking to me? Bro. Oh, hi. What's up? Tell me where to find the Garden of the Gods. You're close. Look for the statues of our gods, created by the sculptor Zonkaku. They stand watch over the garden. Yeah. Probably has where the white smoke is, probably. Look at all the fireflies. That's crazy. This 
Damn. So this is gonna be another like Ronin fight. I know we're the ghosts, but all right, let's go say hello. Statues of the gods. This must be their garden. A shrine, but no spirit. Let's have a look. This note's addressed to me. That's creepy. You walk up, Yarikawa's vengeance has come for you. Whew. Yarikawa's vengeance has come for you. Where is it? Here he is. So you're the spirit. I am the wind that stirs the ashes. Okay. I am Yarikawa's vengeance. You spill blood using a technique that died with the clan of traitors. Who are you? A samurai's daughter? Did you survive the rebellion? No one survived. This is a land of ghosts. All right. Time to get that skill. I'm here who for asked it. you to kill me? <laughs> the peasants who bow to you. The merchants who smile as you pay them. All Yarikawa prays for the death of Clan Sakai and Shimura. Not everyone. Some forgive. The rest weep for revenge. I will bring them comfort. We'll see about that. Time to go. Okay. Okay. We're You're learning first. here. You never should have come. Doubles, doubles, triples, triples. Okay. Ow. Up. You thought. You thought. You move. Yarikawa is your grave. Okay. Ow. Hold up. I can't power up my shit. Where's that technique of yours, huh? What are you doing? Uh, beating you? Learning. I know how to defeat you. No, you will die. Woo! You are a great warrior, but you let rage blind you to the true enemy. The dance of wrath belongs to me now. I use it as you should have. Let's go. I'm surprised she didn't use it on us, though. Maybe she did. I didn't even notice it. That's good. So instead of I uh, triangle circle, now I have L1 R1. Nice. Maximum health increased. Beautiful. Love to see it. It's unfortunate, like, the whole island is being taken over by the Mongols. Mongols, Mongolians, Mongols. <gasps> Two initial kunai? Fuck, let's go. I'm here for that. Let's go. I wanted to say you're awesome, Etsy. Thanks for popping in, dude. I hope you are fantastic. Um, appreciate you, man. <clears throat> Like, the Mongols have invaded the whole island, and they're still holding on to petty grudges. The whole island is fucking getting killed. What are you doing? Okay, I want that equipment. Hold up. Gear? Accessories. No, that's not it. Hmm. Okay. Few upgrades. Hey, let's get it. Thanks, Elizabeth. That, that one felt good.
Uh, I have to find... Hold on. Uh, reduces damage taken while 50 uh, or less. Okay. Yeah, 50% to resolve gains. Gotta look, you, you want those gains, you know? Uh, reduces all damage by a minor amount. Majorly reduces damage taken while at 50 or less. Okay, let's try this one. Hold on. I charge this is one. I should do... What the hell? Right off the bat, right there. But okay, hold on. Enemy airs do no damage? That's pretty good. Hmm. Charm of well-being. I love that. <laughs> what did you get up to on your Sunday, Ezio? What were you up to, man? Charm of divine healing. Hmm. Charm of fortunate return. I like that. Ferocity. Damn. Three of them. Play Assassin's Creed 3 a bit with your son for a bit. Hey, nice. I'm glad you're having some time with your kiddo. Where's the kunai, man? Dual destruction. That sounds savage. Attacks a 5% chance to deal double damage. 10% chance. Damn. Okay. Halfway through the story? Sweet. How much does your son know about the Assassin's Creed storylines and shit? Charm of Swift Return. Stephanie, you're still here? Thank you. But yeah, get some rest. Go go, go to bed. <laughs> get a good sleep. Have a fantastic Monday. Charm of Resistance 2. So I thought there's one like gave me more kunai. I swear that's what we got. Damn. Okay. Well, I guess we'll just go with it. Unless it's one of these big ones here. Revives you 50. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Charm of Toxic Demise. Oh, okay. There it is. Charm of... So through, through to... Oh, okay. So right now what I have is killing enemies restores a moderate amount of health. That's killing them. Hmm. Uh, Iron Will revives you. See, that's pretty huge right there. Huh. I might actually switch this up to this. I think we'll do that. Let's see how that goes. He's seen from Assassin's Creed 2, brother. Okay, so the, the, the first trilogy. Gotcha. Fair enough. That's still a good place to start. I mean, he doesn't really miss out. I mean, doesn't miss out too much on um, for missing AC1 with Altair. Everyone was watching that fight, too. <laughs> okay, what are we doing next here? Hmm. What are we doing next here? I swear that still looks like it's a hot spring, but it looks like the pipe from Super Mario Brothers. <laughs> is there anything over at Toshinako Bay? Probably there is, but. We got to go up all throughout here, see what's up there. And I want to see what this is. Let's go check that out. Is there a fast travel? There is right here. Let's hit that up. Let's go cause some problems. He's got you to tell him what the fuck happened? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's way too repetitive. Yes. Yes. See, that's why Assassin's Creed 2 is one of the best sequels ever. They listened to people's feedback. They basically said, hold our beer. And they significantly made it so much better. And so much good. -der, right? And that's why AC2 is like one of the best in the series, according to a lot of people, right? So,
Here we go. If I'm told you she enjoyed your trip, nice. Save herself. Go, what? Hold up, hold up. Your mom saved people's lives? How? Hold up. She was in a buffet area, saw veggie pot stickers. I love dumplings and gyoza. She got two of them. For some reason she decided to cut up her pot stickers, saw pink. Cur oh. That's tough. Nikki is allergic to shellfish as well. That's crazy. It's a good thing your mom caught that. Because that would have sucked for a lot of people allergic to shellfish. Damn. That's intense. It's actually kind of funny. On one of our, like, first big dates, I took Nikki out to, like, Mongolia Grill. It's a, a place where they kind of cook you. You choose all your food, then they grill it in front of you, right? And me not thinking, I was just like, you know what? Yeah, I could get sort of, you know, go for some shrimp. And I knew she was allergic to shellfish. So I, I get this shrimp in my food. She's like, you probably don't want to get kissed tonight, do you? I'm like, fuck. So I made it a thing to go back to my house. What I said. Okay. I guess you're not planning. I guess you're not planning a good night kiss. <laughs> yeah, she told me you're not planning to have a good night kiss. Okay. And I was like, fuck. So throughout the date night, it was a long date night. Uh, we got went back to my house. I made sure I brushed the fuck out of my teeth. And I got that good night kiss. So, yeah. Not more than that. Anyway, not really. Not really, because I tried to get you to put my, my sweatpants on. You wouldn't do it. No, I mean. Like we've been together for oh, okay, okay. Yeah, we've been in a... Okay, got you, yeah. Yo, what's good, Nilesh? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Happy Sunday night or Monday morning, depending on where you're at. Don't apologize at you. Dude, man, I'm just lucky you popped in, man. Never apologize. Ever. I'm the one who's lucky that you popped in, okay? Appreciate you, dude. Have a great night. All right, where are we going here to? Up to the left. Got it. Where are you from? We're streaming from Vancouver, Canada, sir. And you're watching from India. Nice. What part of India, if you don't mind me asking? Not that I really know a lot about India, but I know a little bit. I think it's absolutely... I love when I get a chance to meet people who are watching from other areas. Oh, wow. So defeat Mongols, destroy Black Powder, eliminate War Camp, recover Sashimoto Banners. Concealed by a smoke bomb? Do I have smoke bombs? Hold on. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, shit. I'm not here. I'm not here. You don't see me. Shh. Wind chime. Black powder bomb. Shit. There we go. Where you at, sir? There we go. See ya. Never saw it coming. I did not mean to do that shit. You're done. Ow, fuck. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Let's fight. That was a bad move, sir. That's your blood everywhere. I hope you know that. Hi, what? Who's there? Oh, shit. Ow. I can do that. Headshot. <laughs> Yo, I gotta lose that fire, man. That's, that's kind of sucked. Can you come to my place later and stay? <laughs> uh, we're not prepped, man. We So we have a three-bedroom, but it's a bedroom for my daughter, my son, and my wife and I. But hey, if you have a chance to come to Canada... Like, our house is a disaster, by the way, just so you know. Like, our ki like we're having a very tough time keeping our kids in line regards to cleanliness and putting shit away, so it's... Kind of gross our house, I ain't gonna lie. It's it's disgusting. <laughs> That'd be a huge lawsuit. Your mom thinks one of the cooks may have opened a package, possibly the shrimp may have hidden the package. I don't know if they did that on purpose, Liz, but I feel it would just would have been negligence, personally. Like, why would they do that purposefully? I don't know. 
I I have a lot of faith in people, though. Right? I feel it would have been negligence. And sure, yeah, law, a lawsuit could be there for, for negligence. All they was done with animosity, personally. Malice, thank you. Yeah, good call, Nikki. Yeah. One game we took out some fresh veggie pods and you could see the vegetables. Yeah. To be fair, though, you, now you're... I'm, I could go for some gyoza right now, though. Why are the sushi places closed right now? Shit. And our Chinese restaurant... Our Chinese restaurant burned down. Oh, man. Fuck. There's a place that's... Uh, there's a Chinese restaurant in, my, in our, our city. And it has been there for years since I was a kid. And we just saw... Uh, through social media, it, burnt, it got burnt. I don't know if it burned to the ground or what, but sucks if it did. If you go to bed, you're going to head out flames to red. All right, have a great sleep. Uh, thanks again for popping in. It was great seeing you. I hope you have a great night. Oh, we got two. Ow. Yo, 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 chill, bro. Woo. Can't stop me. That takes up three of my resolve, though. That's huge. Yo, bro. Get your target, buddy. <laughs> Get turned on. Ha, <laughs> that's great. Do I make some friends who are not from who are from other countries? Not from mine. That's fair, man. That's fair. That is fair. Do you have any friends or family members who, who uh, came out to Canada at all, or just everyone's in India for you? Okay. Well, is there actually... Hold up. We gotta have a look here. What's over there? Oh, it's a uh, beehive. Oh, shit. Those places are actually pretty huge. Pause. Okay, because I look for those banners. The banners are the tough ones here. We're already in here. Okay, got it. Oh, I see Buddy Boy over here. What's up, bro? Oh, no! Got me after the fact. Hope that's a banner. Please tell me that's a banner. Yes, it is. Great. Beautiful. Nilesh, have you played Ghost of Tsushima at all? Or, or seen the game at all? Or is this your first time? Because this is our very first playthrough. Oh, this guy's going fishing. Oh, bad day for this gentleman. No fishes for that guy. Ah, not what I wanted to do. There we go. All right, we're good. All right, let's cross the river. Let's get the bow and arrow and miss it. Oh, <laughs> what you missed, like doing archery? Is that what you mean, Elizabeth? I miss archery as well. I used to be, I used to teach archery. In fact, the place where I used to teach archery, uh, Nikki and Rhiannon are going to be going on like a trip, and I haven't been there in years, and I kind of miss. I'm kind of jealous, uh, but I hope they're gonna, they're going to have a great time there. <laughs> Woo! Be a archery. <laughs> that was great. What's up, bro? Oh shit, my bad. Hold on. You're dead. Hold up. Good night. Okay, it's like that. Done, boys. You're done. Good night. Oh shit. 
Ooh, that armor looks really nice with that blood on it. <laughs> Archer's one of your favorite things to do at camp? Yeah, I love archery. It's so fun. I love teaching it too. It was great. Okay, we have two of four. No problem. Oh, it's like that. Uh. Yo! Okay. Fuck you, dude. You want to do that shit? Dead. That guy pissed me off. There we go. Give me all the goodies, boys. You leaving because you're sick today? I'm sorry to hear that, man. You're head to the hospital? Alright, stay safe. Hopefully we'll see you on future streams, my friend. Take care, okay? Wish you the best. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, shit. You suck, dude. Stop it. Fighting these guys in boats. Okay. Really good stuff, buddy. Okay, I don't want to shoot that yet. I still want to find the flags. Once I find the flags, it's on. It's on like Donkey Kong. You give your niece a bow and arrow when she was younger. Test it out. It was one of the suction plastic tip. Okay. Nice. What's this? What's up, buddy? Ow! Dude! Ring around the rosy. <laughs> Pocket full of death. I want to carry your own bow and arrow. That's impressive. Damn. Ooh, some goodies. I like goodies. Looking for the, the flags. Once again, we get the flags, then we can go after all the other shit. There's one. Need one more, I think, right? Yeah, one more. Cool, cool, cool. Hello? Yeah, archery, archery was my thing. I had a lot of fun with it. No, I didn't want to do that. That's what I wanted. Don't get down! Oh my gosh. Dude, I'm... Bruh, get down! Ah! Like I said, that's the one super bad thing about this game is, is being able to mantle and get off of, like, dropping down from shit. Hello? Shut up. No one likes you. Fucking dog. Nothing really in here. <laughs> Woo! That shield did nothing for you, brother. Oh, no, another one. And quad feed, yep. Oh my god, we're good. Another one. And, oh shit. 
that one. Okay, okay. My bad, my bad, my bad. Shit, dude, stop it! Stop it! That was a nice little run there. It's like that. What's with the fire shit, man? Okay, got a little fight here. Come on. Dude, looks like you got a lot of blood on your shit there, bro. Night night. That's a good little fight, actually. Pretty feel pretty good about that. Ah, <sighs> okay. Who will face me first? Who will face me first? I love it. Talking to shit right now. Dude, these guys like just ran us. We're like, bop, bop. We're not even playing Call of Duty. That was a quad feed. Oh, dog. So I think about your dog. <laughs> Fuck your dog, bro. Kaboom. Kaboom. Oh. Yo, yo, we got shield dude here. Oh, ow. Okay, I'm sorry. Worth it. Badass. Love it. This is so fun. You guys a fireman? Yeah, guys like fireman. Yeah. <laughs> and not a good fireman. He's a dick fireman. Okay. I see a target over here. Well, let's uh, switch this back. I want to use all my explosive arrows. Hold on. The big ass camp. Anything in here? Nope. Yep, there it was. Ooh, Mongol artifacts. What do we find? A Greek vase. So it's not a Mongol artifact. It's a Greek artifact. Liars. During the summer of 1242, the Mongol defeat of the Latin Empire caused a major power shift to the Asian world. An invading force led by Kadan, son of the second great Khan Ogade, swept southward after the devastating Bulgaria and Serbia. Though re repelled during an initial counter in Thrace, subsequent relations between the Mongol Khans and s the Latin Emperor Baldwin II Suggests that he was at some point captured, forced to submit and pay tribute to the Mongol armies. This is likely how the vase wound up in Mongol hands. History be crazy, man. Okay, we need one more Sashimono banner. There it is, right there. Nice! Beautiful. Couldn't have asked for a better setup there. You can say you're resourceful crafty at camp? Gotcha. See, Nikki's crafty too. Me, not so much. A camp, I was more uh, like I would do campfire. I would do um, games, like all that stuff. Your 5,000 year old bowl of that? Yeah. <laughs> no, I miss camp. I really do so much. Time to go boom. I was trying to take a sip and it's like, oh shit, it's gonna blow up. <laughs> hey everyone, come on back, go fishing. Got a nice little town here for y'all to come back to. Increase legend. Video fire without matches? That's impressive. Now, do you, now, do you use a flint? Or do you just use rocks and or sticks? Like, still, if you use a flint, that's still fine. I love this. Whenever it's him sleeping on his horse. I love that. That's such a cool picture. That's adorable, is what that is. 
Makes me so happy. Okay. In this town... Whoa, what the... Sweet. I want to find if there's a place to upgrade my sword, though. This place is so big, though. Whee! Splash. Like, there's a dude here. I don't want to deal with him, because I don't care about what he has to offer. Do you need anything, my lord? Nothing that you have, sir. Upgrade my sword, though. That'd be dope. What do you like about camp? Dust, freshly cut grass? Oh, yeah. If you're allergic to that stuff, that'd make things tougher, that's for sure. It depends on the camp, like, what facilities the camp has where you're at, too. Right? As much as I want to upgrade my shit, I'm not going to search around. What else we got here? Ooh, question mark. I love question marks. Uh, I'll fast travel and we'll move up to the question mark. Now, let's check that out. No flint rub sticks? Damn! That's, that's some real shit right there, Elizabeth. Dang. I could probably do it. I just wouldn't have the patience. I'd be like, nah, man. Give me a flint. Give me a flint. Tinderbox, as it were. What's up over here? Dead guy? Oh, fox den! Yay! More foxes. Hello, foxy fox. Let's go. We're in the serene forest. Where's the shrine at later, Mr. Fox? I'm here, bro. Oh, where'd he go? Wait, what? I lost him. There he is. Okay, let's go, buddy. I had to listen for him. Oh, yeah, it's going to be hit. Oh, there it is. I see it. Nice. There we go. Increased charm power. Dude, that's so cool. So all my charms will actually gain in power. That's really cool. That's very important, too. You're happy that you're the only girl to make a fire without matches. Another guy was the only boy. He nearly lost his eyebrows. What the fuck was he trying to build a fire with? <laughs> was he cheating with some dog? When we went up to camp to do like maintenance work, the cool thing that I really liked about the camps I went to is that off season, we would go back up to camp and we would party. It, they were called work parties. So you would like work during the day, you know, get make the camp more like good for for the people visiting and then you'd party at night right so if we had to do some controlled burns we use dog so it's a combination of diesel oil and gas cup that toss on the fire it's great fun fantastic best way man that work is so fun because you get to have fun while you're working you know blow shit up <laughs> all about the safety of it but hey well i'll talk about that <laughs> All right, what are we looking at here for all of our stuff? I don't see any other question marks down here that we need to deal with. So I think we're just going to keep moving up the map little by little. Well, hold up. we got some stories down here. A wealthy man has all he needs. Rest, you know, yeah, let's deal with some of this shit. Before we go up, let's go down. Pause. Uh, let's deal with this. Oh, he's too close when blowing. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> That's my soul. All right, what's a wealthy man doing all the way up here, man? Oh, he's up in this camp. You know what happened? Tell me. We don't know anything. I want answers. How dare you threaten us? What? 
What's going on here? Uh, my lord, maybe you can talk sense into them. Oh, tell me what this is. About. What are you doing up there? Yo, drop the sword, brother. Be peaceful. Be demure. Very calm. My lord, I am Saburo, a highly respected merchant in Umugi. Respected. You want my respect. Earn it. Ooh, nail him. Are you threatening these people? My family has gone missing. Okay. And these people refuse to speak. Something foul has happened. Why was your family here? I made arrangements for us to escape the island. We were to meet here, then sail for Iki. That's not possible. The Mongol fleet controls the sea. I paid a crew of smugglers to take us to safety. Okay. Unsavory sorts. But they've helped several families since the invasion. Okay. My wife Aki was For the right price. And little Jotaro wouldn't stop crying. I had to do something. We talked about this. Families missing, along with the smugglers. They're dead. And these people know something. I will find out what happened. You will remain silent. Yes, my lord. But don't go too easy on them. Oh, no, stop it, dude. Stop it. Stop, stop, stop. Don't go too easy on them. So, everyone knows, if you've been following this game, it already happened tonight. This guy's wife and child are dead. They're fucking gone. There's no fucking way. Everyone, gather here. I need to speak with you. Speak. This man claims his family was here recently. Did you see them? Anybody? Nothing. Has anyone heard about smugglers promising safe passage of Tsushima? My lord, I think I saw them. A woman and a little child clutching a toy. Okay. Where did they go? I didn't see them leave. Hmm. I saw no one like you described. I want to hear from each of you. What I think is that these people don't want to help this guy because this guy used his money to try and get his family out, and these guys didn't have that same money. And he didn't help them either. So they're like, fuck this guy. That's my guess. That is my guess right now. So why would they help him, man? They feel betrayed by him. They could have been here. There was a little boy playing by himself. They could have been here. I haven't seen any families. Hmm. Hold up. Let me go get this uh, wood over here. It's catching my eye. Yeah, these guys are pissed off that he tried to get his family out of there and they were stuck. And I'm not saying that's right or wrong, but he seems like the type where, like, he uses wealth and he flaunted it a little bit. It's one thing to have wealth, right? If you've earned your wealth honorably, then have your wealth. But to flaunt it over other people, that's where it could be. Uh, uh. People will be bitter about that. They don't like that. And I don't blame them. People come and go. Maybe they were here? This is so vague. These guys don't... See, they don't like him. He's running away. Get him. You. Stop. I don't know anything. What? Yo, what is this? It's Wound me, him? My lord. Then stop, stop running. running, you fool. That's why I said, dude. Then what? Dude, stop and talk to me, bro. I gotta throw a... He's too far away. Yo, I missed. I had one dart, and I missed. This guy's fast as fuck, boy. Just stop running, dude. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Sheesh. I'm sorry, my lord. Don't kill me. Speak. Start talking. The, the smugglers were here. They led the merchant's wife and child away. Okay. I followed, but they caught me. Said if I told, they'd, they'd cut my throat. They told I what? You, they won't get that chance. Where did the smugglers take them? Uh, west. 
There's a watchtower on the coast. They're dead. I think that's where they meet their boat. Why would they, like, do that, though? Like, they've already, like... They've been taking money to smuggle people out, so why would they betray this guy who had the money to pay them? I don't understand. Fast travel that. Yeah, he's the Flash. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Mouse. I'm going to bed. Okay, baby girl. Because it's and I don't stay at this one. Okay, love you. Good night, ghost of Sasamwana. <laughs> you accomplish all the Animal Crossing things you wanted to? Yeah, I could, yeah. That you could, yeah? Cool, cool. Yeah, they do. It's like a free-to-play game. We talked about that. The fact that they're training you like a free-to-play game when we bought the game fully, that's bullshit to me. Exactly! Like, you paid full, uh, pay full price for that shit. And the collector's edition for our Switch. Fuck. No sign of Severo's wife and child. What's good, Bender? Good to see you, my friend. How the hell are you, brother? Hold on. Oh. This gentleman is about to be done. Nikki's doing well. She actually was just here. She's heading up to bed right now. You got news? Sad. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, dude. Um, try to brace myself. Um, it's tough when like sad news is brought because it's like I'm sitting here like I feel for it, but I, I, what can I do? Aside from being like I'm here to listen, right? I'm here to listen, man. Ovaltine? Ovaltine's like a classic. Ooh, buddy's up there, huh? Oh, come on, Jin. Get up there, bro. Shh. Go to sleep. There we go. Like, I hope you're okay, Benders. Like, in, in general, I hope you're okay, dude. Deleting this Google account, a lot of your eight-year-old data. So, could I ask why, though? Obviously, there's something that triggered this. So, it's, uh, maybe it's not... Oh, fuck. Whoa, my bad, my bad. Who you at, bro? Oh, there you are. Oh, okay, you're done. Ah, dead. Yes, run at me. He's still alive? Who's on his horse? What's up? Yeah, you lost me a long time ago, sir. I'm not hurting that horse, though. Oh, shit! Oh, my bad! What's up? Arrowproof vest on? I guess so. Shit. <laughs> that was intense. Okay. You felt like it? So then why is it sad, though? Because you're you're making the choice. I, I assume you're owning that choice. What's sad about it? There must be a reason, like, I'm just going to decide to off the cuff? That seems odd. Like, to... If that's... A, if, if you're feeling sad about it, the question is, why are you doing it? Right? Oh, 
Alright. You else want to fuck around and find out? So we're looking around here. Uh, what are we investigating for? Though? I have no idea what I'm looking for, dude. <laughs> you need to restart. Put my past behind me. This account is a constant reminder. Okay, fair enough. You know what? Fresh start. I get that. So, maybe it's not sad so much as just, maybe you're, I don't know, reflect, I mean, you're reflecting on, on that shit. There's a lot of history there, right? So, I, I kind of see that. But you're doing it for, like, a positive beginning, right? You're kind of growing up, moving on with your life, kind of. I have no idea what I'm looking for. The only kind of house I see is this one. Sex as you have to nuke eight years of history, half of your life, man. This can't start on the Android tablet. So why don't you save some of the stuff that's important just as a reference? I don't know. Does it need to be nuked? There's some things you could probably save, right? Oh, over here. Oh, for sure this is it. Gentlemen. Your boat. What are you doing? Just take our money. Spare us. Shut your mouth. There we go. Yeah, see, I, I guess like they help they helped other people, but now they're capitalizing. That sucks. So you might be sad in that you're like losing eight years, but dude, that means you're also growing. You're moving forward. Look, look forward. Be happy with that. There's 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 something good there. That you're growing up past that. That your your past doesn't define you, dude. I let my past define me for years. For years, I let my past define me. Keep the founding documents and shit. All your day, similar time to be able to, it's basically hoarding. That's fair. That's fair. But when you make the choice, don't stay sad. Be sad. Be reflective, but don't stay that way. Don't let your don't let your past define you. I did, I did that too much in my life. Way too much, dude. You saved us. That's what I do. You're safe now. I... I don't understand. Uh, they said there would be a boat to meet us. There's no way off the island. They plan to take your money and kill you. Was there a woman and a little boy with you? No. Uh, just us. Go home. So where's the, the woman and the, the, the kid? They're dead. I'm, I Several told family you. family might still be nearby. Dead. Cause that's how this game rolls, man. Yeah, dude, there's no other moving people in this area. They're dead, bro. They're dead as fuck. Like, yeah, oh no. Mm-hmm. Oh no. Supplies, never mind. Okay. I thought that was their corpses. Hit delete this channel, which, well, trending upwards by all itself. It's hard to get rid of that. Don't cut off your nose to spite your face, dude. If you were looking to use the channel, like, you could delete everything else. Keep the channel going because you're getting growth. That can earn to financial shit that can help you grow and move on. Just thought. But, once again, it's your call. Oh, dead people here. Golly. Oh, no. Dude, look at the sun. It's beautiful, but horrifying at the same time. You know this. Tell you, if I kept... If I kept the way I was in the past, the only thing I'd be talking to you all is to really press... Yeah. Yep. 
Uh, there's a lot, like, dude. Oh, God, my... this no nope. they gotta be corpses man they gotta be corpses they gotta be corpses yeah if you're not changing and growing you're automatically going backwards you're decaying okay where are these dead people oh I go back. Fuck. You see me download your videos first? Yeah, dude. You know what? At least do something to get, like all that that work you put in. Download the shit and then re-upload it with whatever you're doing. Yeah, that's a great idea, man. Great idea. There you go. We're pausing now, even when you know you're losing it. Yeah. Nice. Okay, I just want to find these people. I feel, like, sorry for them. I know they're dead. Like, where are they, man? Fuck. Hey, sounds good, my friend. Hey. Once again, you do what you gotta do for you at the end of the day, okay? We'll be here as we always are. So you do you, sir. A woman and a boy killed recently. Yup. They're just lying there, man. This game does not give a fuck. Like, this is savage. Maybe Subro will recognize it. That's... Oh. He needs to know. Yo, that hurts, man. That fucking hurts. That. Mm. Damn. <sighs> oof. Oof. It's a big oof. Wealthy man has nothing anymore. My lord, did you find my family? I hate bringing bad news. I found this. Hmm. Jotaro's toy. I don't understand. The smugglers. They lied to you. There was never any boat. No. Everyone in Omugi knows who I am. They wouldn't. They did. Yep. Your family is gone. I killed those responsible. You didn't save them. They're already dead, bro. What kind of samurai are you? You sold them. All of you. You betrayed us. You did this. Blame everybody you else. You did this. People. So, we need to stand together. Take what money you have left and help these people fight back. He ain't gonna do it. But first. He ain't gonna do it. your family. <sighs> Tough thing about people who have money, they think they can buy their way out of everything. I'm not saying this about every person who has money, by the way. I, I'm very fortunate to know some people who, like, my a very, a very good friend of mine, um, worked his ass off and has an amazing business. Um, and makes tons of money and gives of his uh, time and his knowledge. So there's lots of people out there who have wealth, like financial wealth, who are very, very giving. But there's still a lot more out there who have a lot of money to think, oh, I got money so I can get by. And sometimes they do. 
But in this situation, it's like, oh, I had all this money. How come it didn't work out for me? Because other people don't give a fuck about your money. They'll take you from your money. They'll do what the fuck they want. Damn. That hurts, man. But once again, the, the overall theme of this whole st story is when people are put in a tough situation, they make some crazy choices. And who's to say you and I wouldn't do the same? Right? Humanity is so complex. And the choices, like, how do you respond to the choices you're given? Oh, that's tough. All right, we still have lots of shit to do, but you know what? We've spent a lot of time here tonight. Um, hold up. Yeah, over just over three hours. So this is a good one, man. Another good one. Ghost of Shiba still has a lot to offer us, my friends, and I'm so excited to keep going with episode 15, 16, 17. I'm saying this could also, this could be up there in the 20s at this rate. Look how much more island we have. Look how much more island we got. Like, we could get up there like Death Stranding and RDR2. Fuck. Good lord. But for now, off the island. Let's uh, relax by the fire, shall we? <laughs> While we're relaxing by the fire, let me uh, thank all the awesome people who are in chat tonight. Hmm? Stephanie, thank you for being here as always. Elizabeth, thank you for being here as always. I'm so fortunate to have both of you. Elsar as well was lurking in the background. Didn't want to spoil it for himself, so appreciate popping Elsar. Flame Surrette, good seeing you as well. Thank you so much for being here. Edward Townsend, I'm glad I got you back in to playing it. Uh, hopefully you're not going to die too much on Lethal Plus mode. Tenzin was with us. Good seeing Tenzin again, as always. Stealthy Ezio, appreciate you popping in and heading out. And then we had Nilesh from India. Nilesh, thank you for being here tonight. It's a pleasure meeting you. And Benders, of course, at the very end. My friends, this has been a fantastic stream. A lot of fun, a lot of action. We've got a lot of good shit done. And there's still so much more to go. It blows my mind how much content this game has. Until that next stream, my friends. Two nights from now. Stay healthy, stay safe. Go give someone a high five. We'll see you all on the next one. I appreciate you.